Hello, well entrance and welcome out from the Debs. We are about to go into combat against what is a you know a fairly large force, but most of them are pretty small. Uh, there are a couple of river homes which are a bit bigger, but in general I feel pretty confident about this fight. Uh, do I want to engage at range? Yeah, okay, I want to engage at range. I've got some pretty decent shielding, guns, my missiles. I think we're pretty good. Now, I don't know if I want to engage quite at this range. I might let them get a little bit closer. Fortress is on its way down to the new outpost site. They are taking their sweet time. What do they move? Three meters per second? No, that's five. Wow. I've got so used to moving with fast craft. All right. Okay, that's a good range. I believe I would like you to, and I, I quote here, bring it. I don't mean to click any of these. Right. Okay. They're maneuvering. They're firing. Let's look at the enemy armada. A Drake light. Number of different vessels. There we go. And they have got torpedoes in the water now. That is one thing I'm a little bit afraid of, although. <laughs> oh, good times. I'm a little bit afraid of the torpedoes because I can't really do much about those. Those are basically guaranteed hits if they get into range. Oh, you can see that one of the torpedoes breached the surface of the water and our anti-missile missiles fired it, I think. Yeah! And they're actually achieving some kills because the torpedo breached the top of the water and it got fired at it. And mostly through blind luck. Uh, the Drake is being discounted. Our actual missile systems are firing, although they are out of range. Which is fine. We're just going to put ordnance in the water for them to run into if they come this way. Although they do seem to be like, why is the river home just like turning? To... What? I don't know why you're turning. You want to get closer. Oh, cram cannon shells are up. These are the things I fear. The explosive radius has the potential to go straight through our shields. That looks good. That looks too good. Oh, bounced by the shield. Beautiful. Okay, we are getting hit, but this guy has a shield which is protecting it. But a lot of the missiles are now going under, having ripped off the bottom of the shield. Sweet. Cram cannon shells. Yeah, those are misses. That's good. A little bit of damage has been done. Mostly superficial. Oh, no, those are... Yeah, that's a hit. Oh, those are... Yeah, that's a, that's a turret down. And the front missile launcher, which possibly means the missile control systems as well. Ow. If I'm going to take control of the missile systems, I need to get closer. Uh, the, the gun system, sorry. I can't do much from up here. I don't know why the missiles are diving under. Like, the, the river home is a very big craft. Oh, that guy's going to ram us. Nope. Okay, we've rammed ourselves, so it doesn't help. Oh, that's pretty nasty. Uh-oh. Cram cannon shell at the rear. It's fine. Yes. Good shots. Good shots. Closer to the big cannon. Take the big cannon out. Right. I don't even know. Oh, I'm in the water. Great. Uh, I'm going to change ship. Right. Do I have control of cannons? In theory. Uh, yeah. 
Okay, and you're upside down. I don't know why you turn over so easily. I'm gonna have to let the cannons do their thing. AI dead. Yes, we got one. This other one's a pain, though. No! Oh, this guy. So badly damaged. Having our entire missile system basically out of action over here is... Because the entire control system's gone. We need to turn around with this craft so that we can get our control systems back online, really. It is turning now, at least. Is it turning? Please tell me you're turning. I need your missile systems. Come on. Come on. Yes, you should be firing in about three, two, one. Yep, that's 90 degrees. Come on, missile systems, fire. Oh, yeah, it's too late. Sweet. Just don't hit friendly. Whoa. Oh, okay, go for the, go for the river home. Yeah, that works too. Uh, it's wheels gone. I would have preferred you to target the cannon, but that'll do. This guy with his torpedoes I do not like. In fact, where am I? I'm over here. Right, get me out of here. I would like to get... I know this door is annoying, but we can do it. Yes! I am miles away. Ah! I think I'm being shot at. Oh, the Rohom is uh, sinking. Sweet. Oh, hello. Actually, note that. I, yep. Yeah, um, we're good. I think we've won this. I, I didn't need to bother getting out at all. I'm going to go stand on top of my ship. Oh, yeah. We won. Ow, that's my head. Wait, wait, wait. And jump. That's not jumping. Let me on the... Yep, there we go. Oh, yeah. Uh, I'm on top of my ship. Let's let's not... Right, pull all. Now you're up... Now you're the right way up again. The Far Krog took a lot of damage. The Far Krog actually nearly went down there. It almost got, like, ripped in half. Uh, what I will do... Is I'm going to get the cargo hydrofoil to come forward with supplies. And that way you can heal. Cargo hydrofoil. Provide them with supplies. Right. And then go back and get yourself some fuel. Because I notice you're actually getting pretty low on fuel. Uh, sure. What are you? A mo oh, a more! Uh, okay. Um, well, we can do this. Sure. The cost is a little bit damaged, but yeah. You know, I feel good about this ish. Right, and tab, and right, go. Hello, more! Right, most of its missiles have been taken out. Cram cannon shell missed, which is a shame. Missiles are hitting, which is good. That looks like the ammo store. Oh, this cram cannon shell looks good! Yes! Hit the back of the command tower as well. Oh, there we go. Just, yeah, just demolish the command tower. Its shields are bouncing off quite a lot of our shots. But we are still ripping it asunder. The question is how much damage it will do.
Oh, nice. The problem is it, it's got, like, advanced cannons rather than cram cannons. So this big can at the front is nowhere near as, like, scary as it would be if it was, you know, wielding cram cannons. Although we have taken severe damage. Something in the back exploded. I wonder if it was a back gun firing forwards or something. Cram cannon shot. Oh, close. That's better than I would have done. If we go over the top of it and it's still not dead, I will jump out and try and claim it for my own. Now, I have put the lure in for the missiles, which I need to do. So this is like a great opportunity to do the lure for the missiles on the uh, retrofit. Yeah. You're dead, mate. More ammo exploding or whatever it was. That was probably an engine, actually. You look beautiful. You look like a, a battleship out of like the 40k universe. That's why I absolutely love the Moray design. Uh, yeah, you are very blown up right now. Can I come down here? Find out where I store my lure code. Hello, lure code. I would like to um, all copy, 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 copy. Exit. B, tab, B. And then, where do I store my lure code over here? I, you know, for the life of me, I cannot remember. See, I would have thought next to the missiles. Yes. Paste. And apply. And then it is running. Exit. Sweet. Pull all. Turn down speed. Should probably check that they don't need, like, healing. Oh, yay. Level ups. Don't know what that's about. Vastran, you're fine. Oh, you're all fine. Okay. Let's get you to advance over here. Probably have to take out Steady Buffalo. Why is your speed... No, your speed is not three. I need like a control chair very briefly. Control, 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 control. No, not terminal. The controller. Uh, oh, I don't have any resources. I can't afford it. <sighs> but your speed is not three. Why would you not accept that? Okay. <laughs> I hate the fact it's just moving at three. Like, it, it's so much better than that. What's this resource point? Uh, infinite, infinite, infinite. No scrap, no crystal. That's still pretty good. Mostly oil. It's okay. Seriously, moving it free? What the hell? Fight. You can fight. A good fight will make me forget. Okay. TP. And let's find out what's going on over here. Hopefully it's not another spawning zone with like... Uh, it's got a cannon. In which case the cannon needs to be taken out. That's like first point of order. They are doing damage against it. Uh, I do not like these cannons. 
I'm gonna have to hope that misses. I need to go order people to like definitely target this because they might just start targeting our people soon. All target, all target, all target. There we go. Okay. And we're going pretty straight lines, so unfortunately it's really easy to target us. Oh, we must have accelerated, it missed. Hard, hard starboard, hard starboard. Oh, that's port, whatever. Oh, yeah, dodged. Oh, no, that, that took us on the front. Okay, well, I'm just going to keep trying to dodge. Uh, we've missed that one quite easily. Oh. Why not our weapons firing? We should be firing. Oh, it looks like maybe they're targeting behind me. They are. Oh! That's nasty. Okay, in which case... Have fun. Yep, that's missiles. Right. We should be good as soon as uh, missiles clear. That's gonna be close. Oh! Last minute dodge. Uh, yeah, these are not going to be great. We need to actually hit the, you know, the weapon itself. We don't have range to do that. A lot of them are going under the terrain. That's so frustrating. Those ones still, like, hit something, though. We need to get closer. Stop ramming each other! You absolute derps! I'm taking control. I'm taking control. Just full back, full back, full back, full back. Stop ramming it. You've ripped off one of the sides. Please tell me this turret is Swiss cheese. It's still not Swiss cheese because you haven't hit the right part. No, no, you have. You have. Not enough damage, though. Needs more damage. Targeting down here. We really should be targeting a little bit higher up, you know. Yeah, that's it. That's it. That's the right bit to target. Still there. Very little bit left, though. So I think we're good. Yes. Now, target the windmill. You know it's the right choice. All, all this heart. Uh, yeah, definitely this heart. This heart is so threatening. It's, like, dangerous and stuff. And that windmill, my god, what did that windmill do? Not enough, apparently. Not enough. It could have survived its fate. Uh, how did you get yourself up like that? Oh, you're jet engine to turn you around still. You must have gone up the wrong way and now you're... I feel like every ship should have a jet engine on the back just so when it beaches itself, it can still push itself off very, very slowly. Oh, well, you went down easy. I'm guessing, like, we just pinpointed the AI and took it out. Thing. Sweet. Uh, and repair. Okay, so now we have our fortress on site, which is gathering resources. Hmm, excellent. Right. Cargo, where are you? Cargo Hydro Fort. Right. I would like you to move to here. You should be able to grab all the things like that. Wait, what? Why are you going over land? You know what? I, get, I just do not know. I do not know of you anymore.
There we go, and that should create a loop. Which means you should just transport resources to and from to the frontline fortress. It's sort of frontline. Um, well, it is at the moment, because the frontline's still over here, but we are going to be changing that soon enough. Now, I'm hoping when it goes past here, I can use it to make some adjustments. I'll have to be very quick about it. And go! Right. Ooh, maybe I even go to like to a point one speed. Yeah. Right. Play. Jump in. Tap. B. Right. Then put down a controller. And then I can just be like forwards. Maybe actually we could go to back to one time speed. Oh my god. I can't even like press M for the map. What's wrong? Oh, it's because I'm in build mode. Build mode, Q, Q, and force. Why can I not go forwards? What is wrong? I have power, I have fuel. I'm hitting forwards. Why are you not working? Dry fraction. What? Oh. What? is doing this. What is setting my drive fraction to zero? Right, something. Every so-and-so is setting drive fraction to zero. Drive fraction. It's not getting to the correct height. What else should we at? Right, and save constructible because this is going to happen again as the heli spy. Right. Do I need to rename you? Yes. Hey, G. Uh, I don't know why I need to keep doing this. Like, surely it should keep the name that I gave it beforehand. Neko. Pull all. And there we go. Speed 28. That's much more like it. Oh, hello. Who are you, my lovely? Oh, hello. There's a gantry there as well. Um, a ransack. And a ransack. Okay, this is a proper fight we got on our hands now. Okay. I would like the fast tram to get in position over here. And I would like the... Uh, yes, I've got the road tree selected. Sweet. To get in position over here on the waterway. We're going to take them. One from one side, one from the other. Uh, I hope the Gantry doesn't get in the fight, but it may do. If so, then we'll have to figure that out as we go. Uh, right. Although we got the Relic Fit, might be able to help. Depends if it's got a gun or not. Right, we'll be able to take you. But that'll be next episode. I'll be never going to see my Nail Master's tease. But that will be a, a pretty interesting fight next episode. Anyway, if you like, please like, not subscribe, please consider subscribing. I think we take the Ransack and we just push forward next episode. That's... Effectively, what next episode is just going to be? It's just going to be an episode about us going, Yep, mate, you're not allowed to do that. Pushing forwards. Uh, and we should be able to do a pretty decent amount of damage. Now, one thing I will do before we go is build menu, Heli Spy, build, force name, H E R I. Quest Troy and the fleet name H E R I Quest Troy. There we go. Beautiful. And I want you to build. Right. Anyway, until next time, stay shiny.